Whatever. Uh, Brandon Ventrini from Grand Rapids, Michigan. I'm a sophomore here and I play shooting guard. Brandon, first off, happy Thanksgiving. Nice backdrop here for uh, Navy basketball here in South Padre. Happy Thanksgiving, you too, Chris. Uh, first off, Brandon, your very first memory of basketball growing up. Um, very first memory would probably just be playing in the driveway, my first house, my brother and sister. Okay. How old are your siblings? My brother's 26 and my sister's 23. Okay. Competitive group or? Very competitive, yeah. Okay. Always growing up. What has been your favorite basketball memory growing up? Uh, growing up, I'd have to say probably the first time I beat my brother in basketball. You know, he always beat me up a little bit, so finally like I said I beat him up. That's, that's always a nice thing for a younger brother. I remember my first time when I beat my brother. Uh, best player you've ever faced, and when was it? Uh, I'd probably have to be Jared Sillinger, uh, a senior in high school, okay. uh, AAU tournament. Where is he from? Ohio. 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 Team you would like to see added to the schedule and why? Uh, either Michigan or Michigan State, just because you know, that's where I'm from and good team. I think it's fun to play. Which one did you follow growing up? Uh, Michigan. Okay. The most famous person you've ever met and when was it? Probably Reggie Miller last year at the Army game. And it was a good time. Had a shooting competition with him, right? I did. Did you beat him? Yes. He still got it though, does he? Yeah, it's ridiculous. Best part about living in Annapolis? Um, I would say just the, the downtown area, how it's so close to where we are, and just the closest of the community, I guess you'd say. They really support the Naval Academy, don't they? Yeah, yes. I love it. My best friend from another team is? I would say Wes Hudson. He plays for uh, Cornerstone University back in Michigan. Okay, play with him in high school? Yeah. or. Yeah. My best moment at Navy so far has been? There's so many of them. Uh, I just finished in plebe year. I've done with that. You know, shoulders. That's weird. All you uh, sophomores and juniors have said that so yep. far. Uh, how did you end up choosing the Naval Academy? Uh, well, my brother went here, and I always wanted to play basketball here ever since he came here. So I guess he kind of paved the way. I would have liked to have witnessed stuff. Um, Anything in particular? Yeah, I'd say uh, something really cool would be you know, Michael Jordan play in okay. person. Actually, so. Anything non-sports related? Um, Back in history? Yeah, I would have liked to witness the uh, uh, D-Day in Normandy. There you go. Something pretty interesting to watch. Yeah. Magazine cover I would like to be on and why? GQ. You're about the fourth player to say that. Is that the style? All right. All right, Brandon, we're going to go through your favorite favorite things now. Your favorite book. Favorite book. Uh, not much of a reader, but I would say Driven From Within. Okay. Favorite movie? Remember the Titans. What's so great about it? Everything. What's not great about it? <laughs> Your favorite food? Um, I'd say some type of lasagna. Your favorite musical artist? Uh, Casting Crowns. Okay. Your favorite TV show? Um, probably Family Guy. Uh, that's I enjoyed a good laugh every once in a while. It's one of my favorites too. Or uh, Modern Family. Okay. You like the humor? Yes. Favorite pro athlete in a different sport than basketball? Uh, Lionel Messi. Okay. He, he's pretty amazing with what he does. Absolutely. Favorite Patriot League arena other than Alumni Hall? Uh, I'd say Hermes. I, I like playing there. The atmosphere and uh, close to like, uh, how everyone's right on top of you. Like the... Your favorite sports team? Professional. Detroit Lions. The favorite class you have taken at Navy? Uh, probably my ethics class. What did you like about it? Uh, my teacher is just really, uh, he knows the subject well. He makes it interesting and interactive. So. Okay. Brandon, thanks for your time.